Good morning. Thank Assalamualaikum you. warahmatullahi wabarakatuh everybody. Um, welcome back to our Light Tech <laughs> in conjunction Light Tech conference uh, workshop webinar. Dr. Cheryl, very nice to see you today. Good morning. Yeah, good How morning, are you? morning. Fine, thank you, thank you. How are you? Okay, so um, I'm going to introduce Dr. Cheryl a little bit to all of you. Um, as we mentioned during Light Tech, this is supposed to be a one hour session during Light Tech conference. <laughs> but um, we decided that it would be a lot more value if we invite Dr. Cheryl in person on a separate date, which is today, to have the workshop for three hours. So I'm going to um, introduce Dr. Cheryl a little bit more to those of you who may not have um, uh, got the uh, chance to meet him in person yet. So this is your face, virtual face-to-face -face meeting with him. Dr. Shari became interested in e-learning when he volunteered to be one of the participants in 2004 at one of the public university's e-learning projects. Then with his background in software engineering knowledge, so he has a bachelor degree in computer science, software engineering. He's... Uh -huh. Okay. 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 Sorry. Um, he started to seriously learn how to design and integrate e-learning with other education models or concept and also with additional technical functions to enhance students' opportunities in their learning. So Dr. Sharil, sorry, from um, his first e-learning project, was called Diskusi Maya, and you can uh, search for that at www.diskusimaya.com, focused more on his part-time students since 2006, and also designed and developed a new e-learning environment concept for selecting teachers in the Maya project. So you can uh, have a look at this at maya.ilusicreative.com and also maya.sorient.my. He also uh, used a variety of instructional design, online learning environment, and also blended learning to attract the attention of students to remain in the learning process. So his interest in the field of online business is also in line with the philosophy of IR 4.0, which caused him to continue the interest that uh, and he blended it into the formal education activities. So he's, he's really multi-talented, Dr. Sharilia. Um, according to him, every engagement that wants to be carried out in the online environment must start with an understanding of how to build up human motivation to share. So um, I think that's that's quite impressive um, background, if I could um, say that. Dr. Sharil, thank you so much for sharing your time for us. Um, yeah. And I would like to um, welcome those who just came in, our um, Light Tech Conference uh, participants. We I can see Dr. Voltaire from uh, the Philippines. Um, uh, from uh, OUSM, Dr. Varun is here. Um, uh, yeah, and we could we could see everyone again. So welcome back to Light Tech uh, 2021 conference workshop. So uh, without further ado, I will pass the screen to Dr. Sharil. Please welcome. Okay, thank you, Dr. Noaza. Hi. Okay, I'll share my screen. Okay, can, can everybody see my screen? Okay, okay, thank you. Okay, uh, Assalamualaikum and very good morning. Uh, first of all, uh, thank you. Uh, thank you to EDEC for inviting me for, for uh, this session. And I'm really, uh, I, I, I just want to uh, apologize for postponing the session for the previous session okay but uh for today's session i think i maybe i likely i share a few things about this uh digital skills before we start uh maybe uh, in this session we have a few uh, activities or like, like engagement maybe engagement so if you yeah, definitely. I think uh, all of you guys have uh, the QR code app or maybe after this, I will share the link 
in the uh, comment section so at least we can get some uh, engagement from the participant okay so uh, i share uh, our agenda for today's session first i will start with uh, i maybe i want to share a little bit about i call it my my personal framework uh, so so that you you can see a few things that uh, i developed during back in 2006 i think uh, and then i think this is my first time in sharing this this uh this uh framework okay so uh secondly i will share about the this generation gap because this is very important for us uh because we need to declare our audience very well uh, and then the last thing about the digital skills and maybe we'll we'll do some maybe activity lah activity uh like uh quiz or kahoot thing okay um before i start i just want to share because this is a uh, malay uh quotes uh but it, it means um as long as uh the time is with us either we, we call it like uh to criticize uh, to criticize uh, does not mean to uh, oppose agree does not mean yeah support and rebuke uh, does mean hate and uh, dissenting opinion is a good thing uh, good thinking friends okay so uh, and every uh, i think uh, our output for today's activity such as like uh, the outcome the engagement i will share in my facebook so that uh, all of you can download and use it after this so uh, this is my facebook page so i welcome you to to go there and maybe we can collaborate later okay so i directly go to round one okay sorry wait eh. Okay, sorry. Okay, uh, round one. <laughs> okay, my personal framework. Okay, uh, before we start, uh, it uh, started with uh, one big dream lah. One big dream because when I joined education, I think uh, I learned a lot about you know, theory, model, and uh, framework, philosophy. So, uh, because uh, my first degree is not originally from education i'm from software engineering student and then when i joined education i think uh, there's a lot of uh, i think the i i think i learned a lot about human human thing a human motivation human psychology because in my first degree when when um, uh, i learned about yeah software engineering we learn a lot of about uh, artificial intelligence and i eager to build algorithm for for robot robot human robot okay uh, so when i joined education i think uh, I, I i yeah i learn a lot about about human thing lah and i still learning until today so uh, maybe we can start with this activity okay uh, when I joined education, uh, one of my uh, supervisor asked me about what is my uh, philosophy in education, my philosophy, what I want to do and what I want to uh, achieve when I joined education. And uh, he asked me to map my journey until, until how many years will I will be in this 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 field uh, because uh, before this i'm uh, engaged uh, i really love to 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 do a uh, technical project okay uh, so uh, okay about, about this activity actually we, we just want to share about our uh, our philosophy 
philosophy so maybe we uh, uh, for example uh, about this activity you can go to the link or you can or you can go to menti.com and use the code so you share uh, five maybe if if you may uh, share uh, five word that maybe can describe uh, your philosophy like what i uh, like last time when i mentioned to my uh, supervisor i mentioned something uh, lifelong learning transparent uh, what else uh? lifelong learning transparent flexible uh, 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 I, i can't remember uh, what else but 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 the most important thing is flexible trans uh, lifelong learning flexible uh, and transparent that those three three words are very important for uh, uh, d- uh, during my journey okay so uh, if you can share a little bit uh, about your philosophy so maybe we can we can uh, look together when i share the screen so maybe i give you a little bit about uh, three three minutes maybe okay. that's the link okay. thing philosophy of this one okay so uh because uh we really need to understand uh our philosophy and we need to have philosophy very well uh. we 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 look into it and we hold it and maybe at some point we change it we maybe rebrand it <laughs> maybe okay but uh along the way we need to have uh la like, sort of like philosophy so yeah sharing sharing is very powerful things uh, powerful things nowadays and when we share actually we can uh, contribute more uh, to others uh, that that's that's the good spirit lah about sharing uh, but sometimes uh, when it turn into yalah there's no guidance to our yeah teenagers or kids they love to share something that maybe uh, inappropriate in our like nation we have uh, our culture uh, different cul- different country with different culture so we we need to have that kind of uh, spirit lah okay so uh, sharing is uh, important yeah understanding and then learning flexible yeah motivational inspiring yeah we need to inspire uh, uh, because as uh, educators maybe uh, most of us uh, today uh, uh was uh, educators and maybe a trainer maybe leaders maybe uh, we need to inspire people uh, to to grow maybe much better than us uh, so uh thank you for your uh, sharing about this uh, activity as i mentioned earlier i will share you the all of this uh, uh result in my uh, facebook facebook page then you can download it and maybe you can use it Uh, uh later i will i will share maybe after finish uh this session okay uh once again thank you uh, thank you for your uh contribution in this activity so i will start with this posse i think this is uh uh is very uh, like we call it macam like default lah because the four posses Yeah, last time uh, when we talk about uh, 21st century skill uh, with this 4C and right now maybe we 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 add another 5C but the most important thing is uh, we try to yeah communicate we we need to teach this younger generation how to communicate well uh, eh? sharing uh, their thought or questioning something in a appropriate Uh, manners uh, and then uh, the collaboration we need to uh, embark collaboration between them among them because uh, they have beautiful ideas uh, and i really encourage uh, uh, this younger generation to do something 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 new okay 
Uh, uh, before I continue, I just want to uh, let you know uh, I started sh uh, share to my daughters because I have four, I have four daughters uh, in using technology since uh, they are they were uh, uh, one years one one year old. Okay, so uh, at that time uh, we have a lot of no no not not a problem lah. Uh, a lot of uh, we call it uh, opportunity because they uh, they will act differently, like no, like um, uh, not 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 same with the the other the other uh, uh, children. But I think I'm glad I uh, start early because right now my uh, eldest da daughter uh, is uh, 11 years old and she can she can do a lot of things uh, in using this technology okay so uh, and she collaborate not only with uh, her friends but um, her online um, online online friends uh. okay and then the third part the critical thinking this is something like uh, I think uh, we aware of, we all, all of us aware about this and the last one is creativity I think this 4C is not for the 20, uh, 21st century uh, skill but actually it, this is the default uh, for uh, for all uh, human beings okay so uh, when I talk about the my personal frame, uh, framework I call it as a slick Okay, uh, slick, uh, slick. Uh, it uh, uh, shows something. This uh, figure, and uh, each of them have uh, their own uh, explanation. Okay, okay. Ah, uh, uh, this this one, slick. Okay. Uh, oh, a slick. A to uh, adversity uh, caution, uh, and then uh, as for uh, social caution, L. Uh, stand for love caution uh, and um, I uh, intelligent intelligent caution okay uh, when we talk about uh, adversity uh, we, we try to yeah uh, try to measure our ability uh, to go through a, a rough patch uh, in life and if we can come out with without losing our mind lah. okay uh, Sometimes we have we had a, a hard time. So how we handle that hard time? Uh, that is very important. Okay, uh, and then uh, uh, I for for example uh, the uh, with this current context uh, of uh, COVID nineteen, uh, I think uh, yeah most of us have, uh, had a hard rough time. And sometimes we heard about uh, not so good news about uh, about uh, some yeah you know, some people that they have they had uh, this uh, this uh, problem in their life during this uh, COVID nineteen. So we need to teach them how to handle this kind of situation. We need to give give them this uh, example in our daily activity. Maybe okay, this is just uh, an example. And when we talk about uh, as uh, social caution, uh, we try to we call it that, like uh, measure our ability to uh, build a network uh, among their friends. Or their future client maybe, uh, and uh, we and make sure we try to maintain that uh, networking, okay. Uh, and then uh, about the love caution, uh, this uh, actually I I got this uh, love caution when I uh, when I joined one of the training as a Alibaba trainer. And then this uh, fell, yeah, Jack Ma, Jack Ma promote this uh, love caution, and I think it's 
it's very beautiful if we can put something yeah love element in our yeah, activity or daily life where uh, when 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 we talk uh, about uh, love portion uh, it's all about uh, about improving our ability to express love to ourselves uh, not for ourselves first and to others so that's what we, we need to uh, try to uh, uh, try to um, uh, highlight the, the love portion okay uh, and then the intelligent uh, question when when we talk about uh, yeah the IQ I think this is uh, we all of us as educator we aware about the uh, the IQ intelligent question uh, is uh, ability uh, uh, to use our brain uh, thinking we do some reasoning solving problems and ability to understand or maybe sometimes we try to analyze situation based on our uh, maybe past experience okay uh, so uh, we, we, we we try to we try to like use our brain uh, brain uh, to 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 think okay uh, and then uh, uh, the c actually uh, it evolved uh, since uh, 2003 first last time when i used uh, 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 cultural intelligence and then after that i changed it to uh, creative portion because i love to do uh, creative work at that time lah, uh, 2013 and then uh, since 2016 I think when I join or oh, I do a lot of commercial activity then I uh, I think it's practical to to uh, change it because all of, uh, when we talk about commercial we have this uh, this uh, uh, like uh, we, we, we can define and we can still can uh, analyze and uh, distribute uh, ac yeah, accurate, relevant uh, uh, intelligence uh, regarding the products, customer, competitor, opportunity, business environment, and uh, our organ organization. Okay, with 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 this, uh, I we call it CQ. Uh, it can it it, it can uh, leverage. We can leverage the software that we use and services that we can transform the data into uh, actionable insight uh, and then uh, inform, share with others because uh, I use this kind of uh, activity during my PhD uh, and yeah, about yeah, relate, relate with uh, big data, a lot of big data, how to, uh, how to manage human behavior yeah we, we try to predict future lah, based on the behavior and habits during the online platform so uh, and, and at the same time at the same at the same point we, we, we try to uh, leverage which all those habits uh, during that that platform lah. okay and, and then uh, this is uh, I think uh, the next is the, the kinesthetic portion the kinesthetic portion, uh, I think, is uh, very important since I think when uh, during pandemic, all of us uh, work work at from home, and uh, this uh, physical intelligence, I think, it relate with our bodies, and uh, we need to uh, slightly like to we we need to move not move uh because because uh before pandemic we 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 move a lot we go to work and then we we do a lot of exercise we do a lot of uh, activity social activity with our friends we go for uh for yeah uh uh leisure time with our family we visiting uh, and maybe exploring outside 
uh, from our home but during the pandemic most of our time we uh, sit a lot uh, and then uh, i think uh, we need to change that we, we need to have uh, some some physical activity lah physical activity that uh, at least uh, we can maintain our 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 uh, body uh, at a certain certain uh, point because because our body is uh, need to 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 move and to you know, exercise more uh, and then the uh, the next one is uh, emotional caution i think this emotional caution is um is uh uh yeah we 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 need to uh, understand how to measure our ability uh, to maintain uh, peace peace with with uh, others okay and be responsible be honest respect be humble genuine and considerate so uh, we try to uh, understand and use and also manage our emotion in a positive ways lah especially when we want to uh, uh, relieve our uh, st- uh, stress and we try to communicate uh, effectively uh, okay and then uh, the last one this is uh, what we will uh, discussing after this the digital intelligence uh, the ability that uh, we need to be aware and have knowledge of existing and emerging digital technologies their capabilities practice their strategies and maybe the new culture or habit uh, in using this kind of technology because the te- technology will will yeah uh, we will have new technology and the technology moving so fast uh, so that's why uh, we need to encourage all those the 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 younger generation who really into it with this technology and then if they can share their skills and their experience maybe they we can get some some uh, input uh, learn from them okay so uh, that, uh, that, uh, that 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 uh, i call it as a, a slick uh, framework because uh, when when uh, when uh, we talk about uh, digital intelligence i really need to uh, share this because uh, digital is a small part from this bigger framework uh, okay 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 next this uh, uh, okay right now uh, after i share the framework before we continue um, in sharing about this digital uh, skills i think uh, i would like to maybe give some awareness before before we 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 uh, jump into that uh, digital skill uh, information because i think some of us uh, we not agree with all of this information but uh, i share this uh, based on uh, uh, be, uh, for, uh, based on uh, my personal project because uh, See, uh, because I I got uh, this uh, 20, 21 children since uh, I think since uh, twelve years ago, okay, twelve years ago, uh, I uh, their parents agree to to use my my I call it the curriculum in using digital technology so that all of these children will use technology since uh, since uh, uh, one years old and then they will they will use based on uh, what uh, we have planned 
uh, and they need to uh, use this kind of treatment uh, not 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 a treatment uh. we 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 uh, observe their uh, their development and how they will engage with this technology okay so uh, that's why what, uh, one of them uh, was my 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 daughters and then my daughters uh, really i think i uh, you just imagine uh, 11 years old uh, girl already uh, uh, generate her own income and then i simply i think uh, uh, generate her, her own income and then uh, she still uh, learning how to invest uh, and then uh, at the same at one at one point i i also encourage her to uh, playing games uh. okay, about games later i will i will uh, i will uh, share in in uh, digital skills uh, uh, information okay so first we need to understand about uh, this generation so uh, Okay, this is another uh, activity for this uh, this uh, section. Okay, this section. Maybe we can share what uh, what can you describe about yeah the generation gap generation gap lah. Okay, generation gap uh, generation gap. Uh, that I think uh, it occurs uh, among us, but sometimes we uh, didn't aware about that because uh, we thought uh, it's not so important. Uh, but for me, when I I conduct all my project, not not only academic, my commercial project, I really. I really trying to understand human because human is for me is very unique. They can think differently. So if I can uh, at least understand, not hundred percent, at least part of it, at least I can plan uh, uh, something uh, much something else much better lah. okay so uh, when we talk about generation gap uh, uh, it really will uh, give us some uh, some different opinion but uh, I use uh, 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 a few uh, literature that uh, at least similar with uh, Asian country okay so uh, maybe before I uh, sharing the information, maybe if you can uh, maybe share what do you understand about this uh, generation gap. First, okay, wait, I share you the screen. Okay. So uh, when uh, uh, oh, expectation from others, okay, thank you. Uh, and then younger generation different motivation, yeah, yeah, yeah. Younger generation different motivation. I I, I really uh, love that word because uh, because uh, uh, back all my when yeah uh, uh, when I uh, uh, at my younger uh, version. I, I also love to uh, playing games, but today's generation they play games. Yeah, same maybe a little bit like same games, but they play differently. Not only playing games, but they they will uh, interact with the games. And the most important thing when they can interact. Practically, they can generate some income from that from that uh, that uh, situation. Okay, so I I I, I uh, because 
when uh, yesterday when I asked my daughters, okay, uh, so uh, because my daughter uh, right now uh, she uh, playing uh, one game they call it a uh, Gen Genshin Impact, and Genshin Impact she told me that uh, with this game they have uh, 60 level something like that, and then uh, she already achieved 50 something level. And then she uh, got a lot of friends, most of them who uh, really love the, uh, I think, manga, anime thing. And then they keep sharing about uh, how to create new anime costume, something like that. So uh, when, when I uh, gave her... Uh, my uh, iPad and then she she uh, draft something I think uh, figure lah, a new new kind of figure uh, new kind of uh, cartoon maybe but I think it's uh, quite uh, beautiful and maybe we can uh, copyright that 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 uh, activity lah. okay later I will show you in 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 my Facebook later eh? okay so, uh, what else? Uh, scary yet challenging environment, yeah. Yeah, uh, uh, it's scary because, uh, 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 what, how, how to say this? Uh, if we didn't follow the, 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 the generation well, eh, we didn't interact with them, with their own, uh, their own uh, their own words their own uh, mindset uh, because they have a seriously different uh, different thought in using technology uh, okay and then what else uh, boomers yeah boomers can learn too yeah definitely uh, because I'm I'm not boomers but I'm from gen Y maybe gen Y but uh, when I, 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 yeah, I have a few staff and my daughters, most of them is uh, the, this younger generation. They, they, when they throw ideas, I think their ideas is yeah, quite differently and quite sometimes it's not too logic to, to, uh, to, yeah, to, 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 to do, but I think at least we give them some space lah to explore that that ideas. Okay. Let next what else? We are different. Yeah, just yeah. Uh, maybe when we talk about age, yeah, age is just yeah a number. But the most important thing how we think and how we uh we 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 try to uh align with this generation how we can. How we can encourage, or how we can uh, um, uh, not only encourage, we how we can um, benefit or help them to 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 do some yeah new things uh, okay? Because uh, because uh, right now I think with digital things, you just imagine uh, and just imagine uh, 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 my my seven years old daughters when uh, she looked at her her sister because I set her workstation with three monitors and then she already want to have that kind of setting and for your information during the PDPR in Malaysia we have online class I asked I I asked my 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 my, my uh, oldest daughter to to go for online class but at the same time I asked her to play in game uh, why because I want to know either she can focus or not and frankly speaking it give me a lot of I think yeah it, 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 it's surprising me because she still can in, uh, interact with with uh, his session his online class but at the same time she she was playing games, the Jensen Impact game, Jensen Impact game. Uh, so it, uh, they just like, macam 
like uh, the I think the, the, that game is quite heavy lah. But uh, it's still manageable. But when when uh, a sister, a younger sister, uh, uh, seven years old sister, uh, got that setting. She's, yeah, she still want to follow her sister joining the online class, but at the same time playing games. Uh, she still can't manage that lah because maybe uh, uh maybe maybe lah like, maybe not mature enough or they uh still not actively uh participating in that online class. So I I I still observing that that situation. Uh, and then uh at the same time, not only uh uh. uh Uh, I, I I've done that uh, with uh, my daughters. Uh, a few uh, children also. I ask their parents to set that that kind of setting so that they can uh, observe how they can uh, either they can manage that or not. But I, frankly speaking, uh, uh, most of the educators didn't like that. But for me, I really need to test that very well because for me, uh, this Gen Z is very uh, multi talented. But we didn't explore much because uh, sometimes we uh, maybe lah for me. Sometimes I I I do it my own understanding, my own yeah literature. But when we talk about literature understanding, it just based on our uh, experience, our our script of script of uh, from uh, from our life script. Okay, uh, based on our experience lah. But uh, when we talk about they can evolve or they can do something um, much better, then we try to uh, give them try lah. We try to give them something something they can uh, they can uh, explore lah. Okay. So okay. Uh, thank you for for uh, contributing in this activity. So I con I continue this session with 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 the analogy first. Okay. Okay. Analogy. Because for me, since I joined education, I think technology is very important in my life. Seriously, uh, because because uh, since 2006, maybe I I uh, when I want to get some data data like at that time like macam uh, analytic data, I rather uh, I I will uh, I will invest and I will pay some amount amount of money to get that kind of data but nowadays we can get that kind of data freely online using at least like google trend we can get a little bit lah, uh, about a uh, trend uh, using words online but back uh, on my old days we really need to spare some amount of money to get that kind of data Uh, because we have a production house, because we really uh, need that kind of data to to strategize what we need to do. This is back in 2006, eh? last time, uh, last time. Okay, so uh, uh, my analogy with my team, I mentioned to them that technology is like a knife. A uh, knife can. Sorry, uh, wait, eh. Sorry, uh, technology is like a knife, uh, and then uh, if we use it properly, then uh, it will give us a uh, good, yeah, cutting, uh, and then uh, yeah, we can yeah use to to cut or chop things, but uh, we need to understand how to use it properly. Uh, so my analogy normally I will uh, I will uh, I will uh, use that kind of analogy when somebody want to use technology then I will I will uh, I will maybe I this, that is my default analogy lah about technology okay so um, when um, uh, normally we didn't we we didn't place uh, a knife in uh, Our bathroom or living room. Normally, we will uh, keep our knife in uh, uh, in a proper proper place, 
especially in kitchen lah. Normally in kitchen lah. Uh, eh. This is just a typical typical house that without uh, open open kitchen eh. This is just a typical typical house that with with the uh, surrounding uh, kitchen. Uh. Okay, so uh, what I want to uh, share uh, right now, uh, user who uh, often use the kitchen or enter kitchen uh, they will have this kind of uh, knowledge on how to use the knife very well they know how to buy a good knife uh, they they will have this kind of understanding how to uh, keep that knife uh, and then they also will use that uh, in a proper way okay but uh i think oh um, these days sometimes uh i think too many people that maybe didn't go uh, or didn't use kitchen but uh they love to talk about knife uh and the sad thing i think uh sometimes they they talk about knife in a negative way so as we know if we use it properly we we'll, we will get good result but if we, we if we didn't use it you know, properly yeah it will it, the knife can hurt us uh, and seriously it can hurt us so badly so that's why we really need to understand how to use that knife properly uh, okay okay sorry Okay. Okay. Sorry. Wait, wait, wait. discussion sorry because uh uh the uh she wants to to join uh the kindergarten class okay uh the biggest challenge uh, nowadays is the uh, generation gap because sometimes we uh didn't understand the how how the younger generation think or maybe the yeah the previous generation think or want to do 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 uh, things lah. okay so uh, uh this is what i uh, can share about this uh, generation gap this is just a general general term uh, that uh, is, uh, especially when we talk about generation gap it uh, relate with the different of uh, opinion between uh, one generation and other regarding so many things lah. belief politic value sing technology and so forth okay uh, and then uh, how they express their understanding in uh, uh, doing things also very important because sometimes uh, the objective is the same uh, the, the output is the same but maybe how they manage that a little bit different uh. okay uh, and then um, uh, uh this uh general this generation uh, gap is uh, commonly uh, uh i try to refer uh, the, the the general uh, default term uh, uh, we call it as sometimes we get some conflict lah, conflict okay conflict sometimes is a, a positive conflict but uh, normally we 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 didn't understand enough lah uh, what what they they uh what one uh this generation uh want to achieve okay that's why we really need to think because uh they got a lot of option 
during the yeah. usage in using this technology they have uh, but sometimes it's not uh, appropriate doing that in uh, certain situation but it's still logic lah to do uh, that kind of thing okay never mind uh, uh, I continue okay so this is uh, what I can uh, list down the generation the a few uh, list of generation but for me that is not uh, this is just uh, our understanding first uh, I try to list about what we call it as a great generation yeah uh, I try to uh, set yeah this is just an age and before uh, 19th okay but the most important thing the historical event that uh, affect this generation uh, and then the silent traditionalist and then uh, what the histori historical event and then the civil uh, and then the baby boomers uh, as we know these baby boomers most of our maybe bosses still uh, from this kind of generation okay uh, and then this generation x uh, what is the historical event and then the gen z okay why i uh, share about this generation the most important thing if you want to understand this uh, gen z we also need to understand the gen y and before we need to understand this gen y we need to understand who is uh, generation X, uh, but because the because uh, uh, yeah, age is I think yeah, it's a uh, just the numbers. The mentality is very the 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 correct mindset and mentality is very important. Either it is uh relevant to this uh, uh this uh generation or nowadays or not. Okay. Because edge is uh, for me, uh, yeah, from the previous previous literature, previous uh, uh, readings, uh, they told, they mentioned this is just one big, uh, yeah, big reason for the natural gap between this this generation. However, the the major issue arrived due to the mental gap that I mentioned uh, earlier. Uh, in terms of thinking pattern and current trend okay and the this this uh, this uh, gen z generation this gen z uh, believe that they are uh, grown up yeah sometimes because they they watch a lot of youtube maybe maybe okay, based on our uh, our our uh, survey uh, sometimes they think they uh, mature enough to 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 manage things but uh, when we talk about manage thing one of it is money uh, every month we try to spend uh, three, yeah almost 2 to two to 300 ringgit Malaysia to this generation we give them uh, either they want to buy things from online shopping or they want to invest in uh, their yeah. online gaming, they will inform us the 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 record lah, the record the record. Okay, so uh, I think it's quite yeah, I think it's quite surprising me because because uh, if they understand how to manage that 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 uh, that uh, budget, they can. They can, uh, yeah, do some. Uh, they can achieve something, something else. They can buy something because I give example. Uh, most of these uh, children, uh, this is before pandemic. Before pandemic, before pandemic, when uh, we got this kind of data, these children uh, try to 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 uh, use their budget for hari raya to buy something uh, new clothes and new new uh, outfit during me back in 2019 back in 2019 i think uh, at least they 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 can learn how to do their own uh, budget if we can 
uh, teach them in a in like what I said uh, in a proper way, lah. Okay. So uh, uh, although they, uh, uh, yeah, although but the most important thing we really need to uh, always uh, uh, observe them, lah. Okay. Okay. So um, uh, there are some causes of uh, generation gap between uh, this older generation and this uh, new generation. Uh, first of all, what, what we've got uh, is all about the lack of understanding. Uh, and then uh, 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 this generation expect to, to uh, be uh, replicates parents often uh, that uh, uh, try to try to uh, have dreams uh, like like uh, their parents want their, their, their children, this generation do what they plan to be, uh, so uh, something like that, okay? Uh, and then uh, we call it as uh, too many comparison uh, because uh, compare with, uh, yeah, some, some, some of the, the, the parents compare uh, with their life, uh, something like if you, uh, if you didn't, uh, didn't learn or go to school, you will not get a good good uh, good job something like that lah compare with the yeah the the other kid uh, so i think uh, it will give them this conflict uh, behavior inside of them okay and then uh, uh, the most important uh, causes uh, uh, for this uh, generation gap uh, this gen z didn't get uh, enough interaction interaction based on uh, not 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 uh, it's not not enough it's not uh, it's, uh, they didn't get the the actual interaction based on what they think uh, because sometimes we 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 respond based on what we based on our experience based on our experience but sometimes our experience is not suitable during their times so something like that we need to uh, always uh, be open with uh, this uh, this generation okay so uh, this is just a list that uh, i use to to compare with uh, the the generation because this is from one of the literature uh, because uh, based on their char uh, characteristic, uh, this is for uh, traditionalist, uh, silent generation. So at their work, history event, uh, and then uh, this is for baby boomers. If uh, uh, maybe if you want to get this uh, information, maybe later I will I will share you the detail, the detail, the detail one. Okay, uh, and then uh, this is for uh, uh, Gen X when we try to explore more their characteristic uh, because uh, uh, started from this generation we are aware about the element uh, entrepreneurial uh, entrepreneurship uh, in in this this generation okay and then this uh, gen y uh, because uh, because uh, i really uh, uh, I really remembered about the terrorism and the, this Y2K virus thing uh, last time during my, my degree. So uh, uh, this is uh, what uh, affect our mindset in, in using this uh, technology. Uh, and then um, this is the, the Gen Z uh, characteristic. Uh, okay. Maybe it's not... Uh, uh, for me, it's not too detailed, but uh, it shared us something in some insight lah, some some different insight. How this Gen Z thing, when 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 uh, I give you an example, during uh, one of the interview interview session, the interviewee uh, 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 asked uh, how many salary they uh, 
uh, will uh, being paid lah for for them. But for me, that is uh, that is their 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 part. If they want to ask something like that, maybe if they ask in a proper way, I think we just share the information uh, without judging anything. Why? Because I have uh, I had uh, this uh, this uh, uh, this uh, person who I think uh, they do our yeah they they they, they stole our uh, 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 passion ah uh, passion eh? uh, and then uh, I just imagine her her uh, her age. Uh, I think at that time is seventeen years old, but yeah, doing the 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 uh uh we call it like um uh uh she 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 uh she uh promoting our 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 product okay, and then uh monthly her income. Uh, nearly 1,000, 17 years, years old, just using internet, okay, as a dropshipper. Drop uh, uh, she didn't get any any product, but she just just uh, uh, yeah, sell online, uh, okay, and then when we got the 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 We call it as a, uh, 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 the the order. Then we directly post to the customer. Then uh, she got the uh, commission. You just imagine that kind of activity when uh, she got uh, uh, problem with her mother because her mother didn't understand this kind of uh, this kind of drop shipping activity and uh, because she told that uh, it uh, it's, it's nearly something like uh, how 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 can they they they, uh, they gain money a lot of money just using internet so that is the conflict that i think based on back on in 2017 lah 2017 this is just a Uh, real, real uh, situation because uh, my wife and I uh, meet uh, her mother and explaining to them and explaining to to her about this dropship, dropship career, okay? Uh, and then we we explain to them that uh, we are we are a good person, good uh, because your daughter just uh, just. Uh, sell our 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 product uh, sell our project something like that okay so so uh, that is the 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 understanding sometimes we have we got that kind of complete because the the career or the the job scope uh, for for nowadays punya career is quite slightly different because they are using the technology very well Uh, and then I think after the pandemic, after the pandemic, I think uh, the rise of in, in the rise in using technology is quite, I think, quite big and quite uh, tremendous uh, nowadays. So we need to be aware about this kind of uh, habit uh, very well. Okay, so I'm focusing in uh, who is Gen Z because. Uh, this is not the latest generation. Uh, right now, in literature, mentioning about the alpha generation and beta generation, the new kind of generation, and definitely those uh, generation will stated in the list and the historic event. Definitely, they're mentioning about COVID something lah, maybe lah. Okay, but still, uh, didn't get the the literature uh, for those. Uh, new generation but we we try to uh, get those uh, literature or do some some uh, some research based on that uh, later okay inshallah okay so who's this gen z 
normally based on our uh, findings lah. Eh, uh, this is findings back in uh, 2019 lah. In 2019, eh, before pandemic, this is most of them is based on uh, 2019. Uh, this Gen Z is uh, uh, seriously uh, financially cautious if they uh, given this kind of opportunity or thought very well in managing uh, their money. Okay, uh, and then. Uh, uh, this Gen Z is really seriously global minded, but they didn't show us like what the previous generation did. Okay, the previous generation did maybe maybe when they have something they they really want to show that we 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 understand uh, if somebody have something though. But this Gen Z sometimes when we look at them, we think they they didn't know anything sometimes. But actually, they really, at that point, maybe they think a lot, but they think like, uh, like their, their, their generation. Sometimes when we talk with them, we think they didn't, uh, we didn't, didn't focus on what we, we, we explain them, but actually they understood what we, we want to, uh, share. Okay. So, uh, this, this uh, Gen Z is really global minded because uh, they use social media and right now you just imagine uh, yeah when we talk about TikTok TikTok uh, within when if if you watch TikTok and then the TikTok the duration for the video in TikTok is not too lengthy like the previous previous uh, video in social media uh, and then like right now uh, with using of uh, Bigo Live, okay, uh, and then uh, the the connection between the culture uh, have proven uh, have proven to be very powerful. So that that's why when they uh, learn or watch something, sometimes indirectly they learn and they want to do that kind of thing, okay. Sometimes in a good way but sometimes uh, in a not very good manner lah. okay so uh, the next one is we need to uh, aware that seriously this Gen Z is very tech savvy you just give them uh, like what uh, because um, most of my gadget or most of the the participant or the respondent or the subject lah. okay I, I call it a subject lah. subject in this uh, this 20, 21 uh, children need they will use uh, android but at, at one point we will give them uh, ios gadget so that either uh, they can manage that or not they can use that or not and seriously uh, because android and ios uh, have different interface different gesture in using that thing but yeah for us maybe for adult uh, that is similar but some of us sometimes they get confused in using those uh, those interface lah. But uh, with this uh, children eh, the subject they they use that uh, iOS like they don't have any problem at all. They just try try and do that, and then if they didn't uh, understand, they go to YouTube and learn, uh, and then. The the best part about uh, online learning with their own network, they ask them directly uh, in the in the in the platform either in, in the uh, in uh, uh, using uh, Zoom or Google Meet or Teams. Uh. Okay, so uh, uh, this Gen Z is very tech savvy. You just give them uh, opportunity to. To, to to use that technology and then maybe they will explore uh, more uh, but this gen Z um, we, 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 we when uh, we because uh, most of the time they use uh, technology 
Uh, so uh, we based on our 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 uh, data and experience, uh, we think they lack uh, uh, this Gen Z is uh, lacking of uh, work experience. So this is how we can uh, share something uh, about our experience. Just share our experience, not to uh, not to ask them to follow. We just share that experience. So they will use that experience to to the new next level lah. okay uh, uh, like what i uh, did with uh, this those children when i asked the parents to share uh, their experience in playing games in using computer uh, they will use it uh, in a different way still using still playing games but in a different different way lah. different way when they use computer they not only want to do one one activity they will do uh, a lot of things okay and then when they playing games they not only uh, want to play games but they will communicate and uh, uh, do some some yalah, discussion lah. Uh, okay, so uh, this is where we can uh, we can uh, use because uh, right now for now eh, for now we think the the uh, this Gen Z is uh, lacking work experience. They know how to do that, but they didn't have that experience. Okay, okay. So uh, this is how this is a few a few uh, unique uh, learning habits that maybe uh, we try to right now i uh, we uh, we keep uh, uh, observing okay uh, uh, first uh, this gen z really they uh, really don't like to uh, memorize things okay uh, they uh, because for them if they want to uh, uh, solve the problem they will go to the technology itself uh, they ask their friends directly because they have this uh, like circle or networking. Uh, okay. Uh, and then uh, they are uh, multitasker, uh, but uh, uh, not all of them, but you need to observe uh, certain, certain point because when we give the treatment since uh, uh, one years old, I think uh, it will give us a uh, good activity. I just uh, 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 I, I give you example. Uh, just now, my uh, five years old daughters asked me about the Zoom Zoom meeting, uh, but she, uh, she just want to know which one uh, link to use in uh, uh, this session. Okay, Zoom Zoom meeting. Uh, the problem that uh, we've got right now, uh, her teacher give a lot of link. Uh, sometimes it's quite like, complicated with the explanation uh, because uh, for me, the most important thing is just come up with a simple uh, schedule with a link uh, which one to use. I think much better, but uh, they keep changing the link. So it gives a hard time for them to choose lah, which link okay and then uh, the part that i didn't like the most uh, they shared the link uh, early in the morning sometimes we didn't got you know we didn't aware because we are busy setting our our activity for today's activity right so uh, that's why but but when they uh, when uh, she got that link then she managed uh, by herself activity she setting the lighting the microphone the speaker this is uh, uh, five years old uh, children okay so that's that's why for me it's very beautiful if you can uh, if, we, if we can give this kind of treatment properly to this generation for me maybe this uh, this five years old uh, is not Gen Z lah. Maybe this is uh, the the alpha generation uh, generation alpha generation. Lah. Okay, okay. Next, uh, they learn visually. 
Okay. Uh, why uh, we, we we aware about most of the app tools online and most of them will give us this uh, visual visual uh, view. Okay. Uh, in uh, informing the informa- to, to inform the information to share graphically. Uh, so this this generation uh, use that kind of uh, uh, sharing information. Sometimes they 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 uh, not using text to share their their message. Uh, they will share using video. Uh, and then uh, just imagine when it comes to video, definitely it will relate with the space and yeah, the internet, uh, a lot of things. Uh. But they really love to learn it visually. Uh, not on text, it's just uh, not the main things. Uh. And as we can see, their books, their uh, uh, their the books in schools also uh, designed in a beautiful, colorful uh, information. Okay, so uh, they really learn seriously visually. Uh, once you give that, will you give them a uh, uh, instruction visually? They easily will follow and easily understand, and not only that, they will do more. Okay, and the most, and uh, uh, I think uh, this is one one point that we really need to uh, aware, and we need to focus more. They seriously don't verify whatever information they got. When they trust their networking, they trust their circle, their community, they will share that information directly uh, without uh, without um, uh, getting the the real uh, prob- uh, the real uh, information. So we know this this kind of uh, thing, uh, the lack of uh, uh, working experience, and they uh, didn't uh, verify information. So we try to focusing on that situation. That's why right now in 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 teaching and learning, we focusing more on maybe problem, project, based learning, something like that, so that they can explore more. They will give uh something uh, they love to 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 do uh eh, relate with their own uh, uh daily activity. Okay. So, uh, how to engage uh, with them? Uh, definitely, we need to provide uh, the structure uh, because uh, while this generation uh, wants uh, freedom to work, uh, uh, we we try to give lah. We tr- we try to uh, prepare them lah. Uh, sometimes we can prepare, but uh, uh, at some time maybe we need to strategize lah. Okay, uh, and then uh, they will work more efficiently when they uh, have goal, uh, and then they uh, they like 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 much uh, outcome based learning. They understand uh, uh, when we share them. Okay, this is your your target, um, uh, so they will try to achieve that, but at the same time uh, they will achieve more uh, because they don't want to uh, get the same information or same level with the target normally lah eh okay uh, and then uh, uh, next we try to uh, give uh, or, or try to uh, uh, motivate them to join whatever community online or uh, or activity uh, uh, not from the school activity setting but outside activity uh, we we like we ask them to join the community uh, activity because uh, like 
uh, what we shared earlier this uh, this generation uh, yeah yeah uh, lack uh, uh, experience working experience so when uh, we give them this kind of uh, activity hands on activity and uh, they understand what to achieve uh, it will they will do uh, more okay okay next uh, we we need to uh, uh, provide uh, feedback uh, because uh, uh, feedback is just a uh, normal uh, important uh, thing for human uh, either uh, they they when they do something they when they achieve something we need to give some uh, response lah. because like what uh, i mentioned earlier uh, they really need that response that feedback okay uh, and then uh, this uh, gen z seriously uh, uh, they are grown up uh, being taught that uh, uh, everyone something like equal lah, equal because uh, uh, when when uh, when we mention to them uh, uh, last last time we are using computer when we uh, was at uh, university we started going to uh, use computer at university but they think uh, it's quite too too late lah. Uh, to use computer in university uh, because they are using it uh, since uh, since since uh, their children time uh, their their early days huh? so uh, uh, but when we we we, we explain to them um, back our old days uh, we didn't get that kind of opportunity so that uh you they need to use that uh, very wisely uh, during their their time then they will understand to use it uh, in a proper manner lah. okay so uh and next we try to create the teamwork okay uh, because uh, uh they spend their uh, entire life uh, cl collaborating with others online but sometimes they really want to to engage uh, face to face directly and they love to uh, involve in doing things face to face uh, because they want to experience that situation very well okay but the most important thing they need to know why they need to join that activity we need to give them some awareness lah okay uh, the next one, uh, build a digital presence. Uh, that means, uh, like, uh, normally they will upload their YouTube, their posting in their social media. As a parent or as a teacher or lecturer, you give them some credit or just uh, respond to their, their social media, such as like, uh, you just click like, uh, or comment, slightly comment, just a simple words. It will give some some uh, boost for them to do more. Uh, okay, because they they knew that uh, all of the yeah their parents or their lecturer or their teachers uh, uh, still with with them uh, online. Okay. We need to build this kind of uh, digital presence. Uh, and then uh, give them a voice. Just, uh, just we just share. Uh, we just give them you know, to voice out their opinion or their uh, ideas. But not only ideas. We try to give them space. Not only give them to throw their ideas. We maybe try give them space to uh, do or to 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 use their ideas to solve that kind of problem sometimes it, it, uh, i think uh, it give us some uh, new insight lah on how they are doing things 
Okay, but the most important thing, uh, they really want to want to uh, to to explore and do uh, things in a such a new way, lah. Maybe sometimes they benchmark what 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 we have done, but at this uh, at one point they will uh, they will explore more and do things uh, differently. Okay, engage uh, via mobile. I think this is a. Uh, slightly same with the uh, digital presence uh, but uh, when we talk about uh, uh, mobile uh, sometimes uh, we need to uh, aware about the latest latest uh, apps uh, especially like I'm not playing uh, Genshin Impact but I try to play that game uh, uh, I think early this year but uh, at least I I know the character and the flow of that uh, game. Uh, so when when uh, she uh, share that that game, uh, I understand how to uh, at least lah. Uh, at least I understand how to how to encourage her to 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 explore more, uh, especially when uh, involved with money lah, uh, some budget eh? uh, and then uh, awareness uh, this is uh, uh, I think this is uh, uh, just, uh, just awareness because most of this activity when we turn it into awareness program it will it will give us a good result uh, when we ask them to do things like uh, uh, they need to wash their dishes uh, we we explain them uh, why they need to wash these dishes, uh, why they need to do that that kind of activity, uh, the awareness that give them uh, benefit uh, to their uh, life, not to to uh, uh, like like what I always mention when you uh, wash your dishes, at least you can uh, interact with uh, your hand with your the uh, with water. And then it will give a uh, benefit to your skin, uh, moisturize your skin, something like that. Lah. So uh, when they understand that uh, benefit, well, then they will they will uh, do it uh, more and regularly. Lah. Okay, and, and then uh, oh, then is uh, some some data I, I forgot to 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 erase that. And then the last one uh, offer uh, flexible uh, scheduling. When we try to offer uh, uh, flexible scheduling, uh, that means we try to discuss with them. Uh, we try to discuss with them. We try to negotiate with them if they can involve with whatever activity we want. Uh, so I think that that is a uh, good thing uh, about this uh, this this generation okay so uh, uh, how they engage uh, uh, how, uh, how does uh, Gen Z need to engage in learning definitely they really want to do things seriously very fast they want to know uh, in the easiest way short and precise Lee, uh, okay, uh, and then uh, they prefer uh, use uh, graphic and connected activity, especially in using technology. Uh, and then uh, they really do, you know, sometimes they do uh, uh, do things very fast, lah, okay, very fast. Uh, so either we can catch up or okay, pop up or not. Uh, it depends on our 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 skill. Lah. Sometimes we ask them to slow down. That's the problem, because uh, we holding them back based on our uh, our generation, back on our our our, our style. Lah. So uh, that's why when they want to do and they do it. Uh, in a proper and correctly, then we leave them to explore more. Go, uh, okay. Uh, like uh, last time, uh, when uh, some of the one, a few of the children, uh, they 
uh, we ask the parents to give their children i think uh, i can remember uh, 9 to 10 years old uh, children uh, to planning their own vacation so it shocked us when they uh, search uh, in uh, agoda or something like that i can i don't know where they get that kind of idea maybe from the commercial i think commercial commercial or from youtube i have no idea but they search that and then they give uh, their parents idea where to stay so it quite uh, impressed me lah okay uh, and then uh, interested in interactive multimedia definitely uh, when they can interact with the technology Uh, and then um, uh, the yeah they need to get a clear goals uh, and then if something that can benefit them definitely if they can get some reward and at least they will gain some positive uh, positive feedback lah positive uh, for positive uh, yeah positive feedback lah okay and then um, Uh, this is the I think uh, not a problem. Uh, this is opportunity for us as adult or the previous generation. So because uh, their uh, attention span is very short, uh, so we try to give them uh, in terms of yeah, like information. We try to give them uh, proper. Uh, practical information lah. Uh, if, if if we want to use a video, then maybe within uh, 30 second or one minute, we 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 already uh, give the information. Uh, that's why uh, nowadays when we uh, see the trend in the social media, in YouTube they have shots, uh, and then uh, you have a story. IG story, um, most of those uh, media, uh, the duration is not too lengthy. Uh, maybe sometimes uh, 15 seconds uh, already uh, shared some information, some important information before they uh, explore more. Uh, at least uh, the information is there. And then, uh, like this. Uh, learn more effectively. Okay, uh, the most important thing, like what I mentioned earlier, because they uh, didn't have this uh, lacking work experience, so we try to give them some problems, uh, real problem, so that they uh, try to manage and solve it by themselves. Uh, so we try to give that kind of uh, situation. So they will try to uh, manage things differently uh, using. I give example uh, last time when I asked the parents, please don't give your children. Uh, yeah, because one of the activity we we ask the parents not to send their children to tuition. Just send to the send the uh, uh, children. To school lah, just a normal school daily daily activity. Uh, we didn't mention about tuition, but uh, frankly speaking, when they uh, think that they, they want to have a tuition, they will ask their parents, and they want to pay by themselves. Uh, they 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 share what kind of tuition, uh, where and how to go there. So it quite. Something uh, shock us, uh, because we didn't we didn't uh, talk about we didn't uh, discuss with uh, the children about tuition, but they asked the parents to go uh, to 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 to, uh, to have uh, a class tuition. So uh, there is something uh, I think uh, positive way lah because they really want to explore and go, but at the same time they're willingly to use their own money because 
because they know uh, their parents didn't want to atau didn't want to uh, uh, plan all of those uh, things lah. So, okay. And the next one, uh, uh, ability to appre- express uh, okay opinion, access to much data, okay, because uh, they will answer uh, quicker than uh, than others gen- and than other generation. But like what uh, I mentioned earlier, the uh, uh, time spam uh, a little bit uh, shorter. Eh? Uh, and then uh, next, uh, they didn't didn't uh, uh, we call it uh, didn't when they share something they just share based on the their 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 community. Uh, and then um uh, what is this uh, cheating or hacking okay when you talk about cheating and hacking uh, uh, uh this is uh, a small small uh, not all of the children uh, got this idea but uh, some of them will have this sorry cheating and hacking uh, because because uh, some some of them uh, got this idea uh, how to how to you know, how to not cheat lah they they do it uh, in a in a, um, a different way lah i give you example lah uh, uh, when uh, okay uh, when they went to their uh, religious school uh they want to they want to and uh, sell something lah a uh, bracelet uh, they know they knew that uh their children and uh, their, their friends want to uh get that uh bracelet so sometimes they will um uh they will uh set the price in a in a not not what what I call it, uh, not uh, appropriate price lah. Uh, sometimes quite higher lah. But they 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 uh, they manage to uh, sell those uh, those uh, uh, bracelet lah. That that's just one example because they will encourage and then they will share uh, slightly like a. Uh, um, marketing person uh, and then uh, they will show the information about uh, so this like 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 marketing marketing things uh, okay because they they knew uh, uh, so much about uh, online so they will relate what uh, they, they they knew earlier okay so uh, this gen z learn discover curate uh, and manage information okay and then prefer to work uh, in teams or small group. They really, really look into it in uh, uh, group work or collaborative activities. Huh? Seriously, uh, that's why. That's why when when uh, when uh, learn, uh, I give example. Uh, three years uh, old children. They 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 already played uh, among us one of the games. But they want to play with their own network, uh, their own group. Three years old, uh, and then uh, this three four years old, uh, 
if they want to communicate with their friends, they already knew how to use the Google Meet. I have no idea how they managed to use that, all those, those uh, tools. This is what uh, their parents uh, told us. Uh. Okay. So it quite something. Uh. Okay. So uh, this, is, this is one of the uh, quotes from Sayyidina Omar. Uh, educate the children according to their time, their age, because they will live in a uh, different from ours. So we need to understand uh, when we share or give instruction, we still uh, need to give them some uh, alternative uh, to do that in a different way, maybe uh, to do a uh, 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 in a different and new ways, okay. Maybe we 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 can uh, always try that. Okay. So uh, what what I uh, shared just now, uh, focusing more on Gen Z. Why? Because we really need to understand Gen Z first before we can understand the new generation. This new generation, uh, this new generation is uh, we call it Alpha Gen. Uh, eh? Maybe their 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 behavior slightly same with the Gen Z, but uh, definitely uh, they will uh, they will uh, they will learn or uh, they will interact differently uh, eh? uh, What I uh, what I shared. Uh, the four or five years old, if they want to communicate with their friends, they already use Google Meet, not phone, though, Google Meet, because they want to Google Meet and then WhatsApp video. And then if I can later, I will share you uh, my my own uh, daughters, uh, four years old daughters already use uh, what, um, WhatsApp video, something like that, lah, uh, to uh, communicate with with all our family members with her uh, grand uh, grandfather uh, grandmother because uh, almost uh, two years uh, we didn't meet each other so just imagine this is uh, the good thing and how we can uh, maximize their talent with those activity maybe it's not uh, it's not same with us but i think we can uh, explore more Okay, so uh, right now we just know about all of these things, but uh, normally we 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 aware lah most of those uh, criteria, but uh, I think it's not enough because we really need to apply that. We need to maybe uh, seriously we try to. Uh, uh, explore more. Why I always uh, keeping uh, uh, said that we need to explore more because when when uh, when we talk about our uh, uh, education curriculum curriculum our curriculum, I think sometimes the curriculum uh, sometimes eh, was made based on our our life or our understanding in uh, understand the how to understand the, that content but when we look into how they manage things if we give this curriculum since the early days uh, 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 what I mentioned about early days maybe uh, if we give them this opportunity earlier in using this Technology, I think uh, they will uh, evolve and uh, do something yang quite, quite. I think I I really love that uh, in exploring this kind of human. Okay, so I think that's all for our uh, second session. So this is the main and the last session about the digital skills. And uh, I hope uh, we can link in each of uh, uh, this uh, sec uh, uh, session. Okay. 
So this is the third session. Uh, most of it is uh, uh, sharing about the digital skills. But when we talk about digital skills, uh, uh, try to think something. What do what uh, what is digital skill? What is digital skill actually? Uh, what is this digital skill? We we always mention about okay, we need to do uh, or we need to do or we need to learn digi digital skills. We need to understand digital skills. But actually, uh, for us, okay, for us, what is uh, digital skills mean? Or what is digital skills? Okay, so uh, before I continue, as usual, uh, normally I'll share you, maybe you can list uh, at least five digital skills that we must teach our children. Okay, what is, uh, yeah, first is to, we need to understand uh, what is digital skill. But the most important thing uh, for this activity, just list down uh, just only five. Uh, five, because we have a lot of digital skills. But what is the, maybe for, for, for no, maybe in your understanding, what is the uh, most important uh, digital skill that you want to share with this uh, generation? Uh, okay, so uh, as usual, you can go to uh, 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 the link. Okay, uh, you can go to the mentee uh, or and uh, put this uh, code, or you can scan the the link because uh, when when um, when uh, last time uh, last time last time when when I asked. Uh, one of the group in in one of the training workshop, I asked them, uh, "Do you understand what is a uh, digital skill? Uh, what do you mean by uh, this digital skill term?" So when they mentioning something, okay, digital skill is coding lah. Okay, for me, yeah, it's still uh, true, but most of most of the participants, uh, they will share something. Memang tak ada responders to the cut you with Hello? Sorry, sorry. I think that was a mistake. Yeah, please carry on. Okay, sorry, sorry. Okay. So, uh, okay. Uh, I show the result. Maybe we can share uh, our, our, yeah. We try to list the five picture skills. Maybe if you got this opportunity, what do you want to teach them? Okay, what to teach them? Yeah, I love that social media. This social media thing is very because right now I exploring more about the the behavior behind the social media. Not only the behavior, how to do it uh, automatically, <laughs> do it that 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 uh, interaction uh, automatically. And when we explore more in the, yeah, where we talk about IGS or Facebook ad or TikTok ad, I, I, I joined that class and I think oh, it's very wonderful class. Uh. Wonderful class because, um, why? Uh? Because for me, uh, we need to explore more when we talk about social media. Social media is the place where we uh, gather together online. We share something online. But uh, we need to aware when we join certain social media, it will give us uh, what we call it as a term of redirect, redirecting, redirecting term. Lah. Uh, that means when I uh, click on uh, one activity, uh, such as, uh, I love to look at uh, 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 oh, okay, uh, online training. So, it will, uh, all of a sudden, all the ads will show about online training, online training, online training. 
because they want you want us to uh, benefit more uh, to get those uh, online training then it depend on us either we uh, 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 we we can manage ourselves lah uh, when when i want to buy some uh, i want to buy uh, i want to buy uh, what ah oh i want to buy hard disk i click on one link online link lah uh, maybe i want to uh, in shopee or in lazada maybe alibaba so all of a sudden all the ads will will uh, focusing on um, hard disk why because they try to give us that kind of benefit uh, to 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 buy that 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 thing lah for me is good is very good because sometimes uh, we just survey but at some point like today is uh, 9 9 eh? 99 so when you uh, 99 in shopee on lazada it will give a lot of uh, promotion so you can plan your your activity well lah because uh, earlier uh, earlier earlier uh, today uh, my daughter asked me uh, she wanted to uh, to buy something lah because she wait, uh, wait until today to to buy that things eh? so you just imagine they plan their own what they want okay next what transaction verify resources yeah verify resources resources is very important so we need to focus more how they can verify more lah about this this uh, kind of information ni because kalau tak uh, verify very well i think uh, if we didn't uh, Uh, didn't teach them or didn't give them um, how to do that how to verify it. well i think i think this generation will 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 do whatever they think is okay though because sometimes it uh, it will hurt uh, some other human uh. okay Okay, online communication. Know how to use computer. Okay, know how to use computer. Uh, yeah, still okay. But uh, right now, I think uh, that is uh, hopefully lah. We can learn it uh, in schools at least lah. Eh, how to use it? How to use that computer? But for me, if they can uh, learn how to use gadget, not only phone but iPad. iPad, uh, they can learn it uh, properly, and then I just imagine eh, when when we compare, when we compare, this is not promotion promotion hand eh? compare eh? compare when we use iPad with a uh, tab with pen Galaxy pen uh, pen eh? uh, they uh, think uh, this I don't know the This uh, iPad pencil is very slightly like a real pen. So uh, this is uh, they 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 give that kind of opinion uh, when we compare we compare with uh, not pen uh, and uh, or tap. Ilah Galaxy or I don't know the the Android Android tap lah with the the pen. Uh, when we compare uh, give that 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 uh, environment to another children uh, then they share their opinion or oh, this is not so uh, their, their experience uh, on using that kind of uh, interface they express that kind of uh, feeling that kind of feeling okay i for me that's that, that's good lah uh. we we got that 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 idea sometimes we buy galaxy because we don't have enough budget something kan but but the most important thing when we we can get that kind of uh, tools uh, pro- properly uh, for me ipad is quite expensive lah but but it's good when uh, we we we've got the 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 experience when they express their experience on how they using pen slightly much easier and have that kind of feeling true feeling like a true pen uh. so i think that is a uh, Uh, priceless uh, that feeling when they shared uh, that kind of feeling with us okay so uh, what else 
do and don't ah do and don't is one thing that's why we need to need to declare lah do and don't because i give you example one thing uh, when one of the teachers uh, they ask my daughters to switch on uh, camera tau because my daughters uh, they they uh, uh, they, they knew that uh, it's not necessary to on the the camera because uh, something about uh, google punya law back in us lah eh uh, because uh, 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 and then uh, they have some macam sort of law tau in in, in uh, switch on the camera uh, because uh, this this group of uh, uh, generation eh younger generation ni memang they sometimes they didn't want to switch on the camera but for the sake of the teachers i ask the my my daughters to switch on lah for me it's, it's still good but but we didn't have that kind of uh, law yet because sometimes we we didn't we didn't get that kind of uh, uh, I, I don't know lah logic thinking maybe because we didn't get we didn't have that kind of uh, uh, the structured punya uh, instruction though. either we can use it or not and then uh, right now uh, definitely when we talk about internet internet connection is not that good uh, and then uh, okay uh, okay, that that kind of thing lah. Okay, so uh, when we talk about do and don't, I think that is a practical way if we can list down that, so that uh, this generation will realize what they can do and they don't. Uh, so and that's one thing lah. Cyber security, yes. Valid information, okay. Communication using some, okay. Know how to use Google, okay. Know how to use Google, okay. Uh, frankly speaking, uh, last night I I was attending uh, one of the Google uh, Google uh, data something lah last night when I joined that class. I think uh, right now we have a lot of uh, data database, uh, but uh, we didn't manage it very well. So uh, yeah, that's good if we can we can we can we can uh, teach them how to manage things from the beginning earlier how to manage things uh, uh, is good because uh, if uh, I think based on this is based on 2019 eh? based on 2019 uh, a few of them uh, already exploring uh, explored, uh, in using Google form yeah, they want to ask uh, they want to uh, conduct something macam party with uh, party their own birthday party eh, i think uh, this is one of the parents that cheated lah, uh, mentioned to me so uh they asked their friend what they want from that party lah uh, just a simple simple google form punya function and then uh they share the link uh, and then it's quite much um uh, they try to uh not impress others lah. they try to ask their friends to to share the opinion how, how they want what kind of uh, party so uh, this for me for me is good lah. okay next uh, where or digital bullying okay term of uh, of its language okay using camera correctly okay online okay i think presentation skill okay okay that's all okay thank you thank you okay i continue we don't have enough time right now so this is just my quote I don't know lah. This is just my quote because we 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 always uh, need to understand uh, uh, the world that we are preparing. Uh, this this generation seriously, memang different. Uh, definitely different lah. Uh, when we compare with our 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 old days, eh? uh, last time we didn't get this pandemic, and uh, right now we 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 experience it by ourselves, but. As a uh, adult, ah, uh, can but the children experience it earlier than us, uh, and then in Malaysia, I think uh, since how many months, uh, they can't go out uh, because of the instruction from the government. 
So it will uh, affect their experience and their life experience. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Okay, so uh, this is just uh, from Abraham Lincoln. Uh, the, best, the, the best way to predict future is to create it. So we right now, uh, what I uh, sh uh, share to you, because uh, when I joined education, I learned about a lot of things about theories, about Albert, about uh, whatever theories. Then I talk to myself. I think, oh, I want to create a theory lah. So when I got, uh, when I got, uh, I got uh, children, I want to test this thing for, to them, uh, especially in uh, in digital uh, in technology lah. Uh, eh? So uh, and then uh, some of my friends want to join that kind of philosophy, this activity because uh, they knew how I manage things ah, back in university last time. Uh, because I really want to get some macam certainty lah, uh, how to manage, how to use this kind of things, in, especially in te this te technology lah. Okay, when we talk about digital skill, this is just a, a term, eh, the term, a range of abilities to use uh, digital devices, communication, application, and networks to assess and manage information. And then they're related to the digitally uh, literate. Okay, this is just a uh, just a, a term. Okay, okay. This is uh, what I really want to share. Uh, when we talk about digital skills, first we try to try to explore a a, a several several uh, 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 domain domain sub domain domain. Okay. Uh, so this the 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 uh, domain first we uh, we start with digital identity, digital use, digital safety, digital security, digital emotional intelligence, and digital communication, digital literacy, and digital right. Okay, this all of this uh, came from the uh, DC Institute. Uh, DC Institute for me uh, it give me a lot of ideas in this digital uh, digital skills because last time back in uh, when my uh, my master i uh, macam uh, create awareness in using technology lah especially uh, uh, and using ha ha uh, how many hours in using the practical way in using technology uh, and i'm happy because it uh, it being touched in this in this uh, this uh, digital skills, okay. So uh, first we talk about digital identity. When you talk about digital identity, uh, uh, this uh, ability uh, to create and manage uh, one's online identity and reputation, and then it includes an awareness of uh, uh, online persona and manage uh, management of uh, short term and long term impact uh, of uh, one of yeah online uh, presence uh, and then uh, ability to build and manage a healthy identity as a digital citizen with yeah, integrity lah. Eh? so uh, this is uh, dia punya sub sub domain uh, sub domain uh, Eh, uh, digital citizen, digital co-creator, and digital entrepreneur. That is very important if we can teach them how to uh, to do the entrepreneur thing online. Uh, for me, uh, it's good because uh, we we have a lot of uh, pl online platform. If we can't uh, build our own e-commerce, we still can use others. But at the same time, the process or the the platform that we can use is very important. First, when we, when we talk about digital entrepreneur, uh, yeah, the the term is uh yeah, is like a uh, individual who use internet uh, as a tool to uh, create something commercial opportunities uh, opportunities uh, eh, and then uh, share information and collaborate with the client or partners. So that is that is something um, something good because they are still engaging with the real person, but through online, lah. Okay. 
uh, and then uh, they will uh, develop their own their own uh, competency in yalah, selling things ah eh, when we talk about this uh, digital entrepreneur eh. uh, and then uh, they sorry and then uh, they try to understand uh, how to monitor integrate uh, the technology itself uh, i give example like uh, like this is previous previous activity when uh, when we relate with uh, we, we we ask our daughters to sell not sell, we, we ask that we ask her to uh, how you how how can you you sell this thing uh, sell uh, their their own brand lah because uh, we created uh, one brand for them uh, so uh, they try to uh, uh, sell them with with, with uh, online uh, and then uh, when when at the first you know, the first experience too uh, they quite yeah uh, she quite shy or not I think not to 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 the 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 the, the graphic or the the video is not to 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 commercial lah. Uh, when they when they uh, watch that video back, they think they need to do more. Need to improve lah. Uh, so they have their own um their own uh, target when 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 they know uh, uh, what 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 was the task eh? so uh, this is the digital uh, entrepreneur uh, and then uh, the next uh, is the digital co-creator co-creator when we talk about digital co-creator uh, they can uh, we, we call it as macam create not create not only create the co-create co-create they they um with this uh identity they will uh do more uh, okay like they benchmark something but at the same time they 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 will explore more and do it uh with their own style uh okay and then the last one the digital citizen is digital citizen uh uh yeah engage uh, and then responsible with the content that uh, they shared like, like right now uh, covid information uh, when we ask them if you want to share something about covid information please go to the telegram kkm or okay? the the official 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 uh platform yeah they will go there and then they want to share with their friends because they're eager, want to know where, when they will, they can uh, meet face to face. So they keep, uh, keep, keep, uh, keep uh, updating the the COVID num, uh, the COVID, uh, COVID information, and then they share with uh, their social media and and their WhatsApp group with their friends. Okay. So uh, there's digital identity. Okay, and then uh, next, the second one, digital use, uh, the ability to use uh, digital devices and media. Okay, including the mastery of control in order to achieve a healthy balance between uh, online and offline. Uh, between okay, online and offline. So when we talk about digital use, because I love this thing and this 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 uh, domain, eh? why? Because uh, uh, it um, because there are uh, a few awareness lah about screen time, with digital health, uh, and then uh, community uh, participation. When we talk about digital uh, apa, uh, screen time, uh, it. Uh, Macam term lah, term, uh, it, it's a term used to uh, for activity done in front uh, screen lah, either handphone or laptop, eh, watching television ke, uh, playing video games. So we need to get study more about that screen time. 
because uh, nowadays punya screen handphone screen is quite beautiful but at the same time they have a lot of um, I think blue screen eh. the term is blue screen and it will uh, give us uh, our eyes is not so good condition lah because uh, it's beautiful or too 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 the light is too sharp eh. sharp it will injure our eyes lah uh, that that's the most important thing because uh, actually I my because in in my family I'm the only one who uh, wear spectacle uh, why I spect uh, wear spectacle because uh, back in uh, my degree software engineering I do a lot of uh, programming. Uh, eh, 24-7 we are using computer, do the eh, online thing and it yeah it hurt my eyes. Uh, and then uh, uh, yeah, right now I uh, if I want to read anything I need to wear my spectacles. Uh. And then uh, digital health. Yeah, uh, I still uh, wear some gadget so that I can monitor my heart bit uh, and then uh, you just imagine nowadays since COVID most of the family have this what uh, oximeter eh? uh, this oximeter thing because I never knew that tools before uh, until co- this COVID eh? uh, I realized that okay this oximeter can at least give us some information about oxygen Okay, for information, actually, I still in quarantine for COVID. For COVID, uh, today is, was my uh, uh, seventh, seventh day. I have three days more to uh, to quarantine. Okay, so quarantine about COVID because all of my family member affected with this COVID. It seriously is something is new for us seriously okay this covid better uh better uh, you uh, all of us be careful lah about this uh this covid okay so uh uh when we talk about uh digital health uh we can use tools we can use uh we can experience a lot of things we can when we we got the data from the macam gadget ni at least we can uh, make a decision what to do next uh, that's very important at least we we can trying to predict the future lah not predict the real one lah but at least we 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 aware earlier lah uh, what to do next okay so that is just uh, the the beautiful things uh, about this this uh, this tools lah uh, our heartbeat our our at least our activity to re- record actually i i will o- wear this uh this gadget uh in my sleep i also wear that because i want to track my heartbeat uh and then after that uh, depend lah uh, okay what to do next okay okay next one okay next one digital safety like what one of our friends mentioning about the cyberbullying. Cyberbullying is very uh, something uh, uh, that uh, dangerous thing uh, for this younger younger generation because they still uh, didn't uh, experience much how to uh, communicate in uh, with uh, with uh, with this uh, human being. Okay. That's why uh, we need to uh, monitor, always monitor them. And then uh, sometimes we, yeah, because uh, in this activity or this project, not project, actually, uh, I try to design my life. Every month we will do uh, our own postmortem. postmortem so uh, most of our daughters will have uh, time to speak, speak out or uh, share something that maybe I didn't wear, wear off, then uh, at least we can, we can, we can uh, improve lah for the next, next, uh, next month. Right? Okay, so cyberbullying is uh, 
something something uh, something okay So, uh, uh, cyberbullying uh, can occur through uh, this technology, SMS, text, or online social media, forum, gaming, yeah, gaming and uh, uh, whatever sharing content, sharing content area online, normally online lah. Eh. Uh, it includes uh, something like macam uh, sending, posting, sharing, negative, harmful, false and mean content about someone else. So we need to make sure our generation didn't do that kind of things because it can hurt somebody lah. Yeah. So we uh, always need to, uh, like, like macam body shaming also is something we need to, I mean, we need always uh, be aware lah. Uh, because sometimes uh, our our yeah, children or younger generation ni they speak directly without any 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 uh, they they just want to throw out their 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 uh, uh, their their what they want to see uh, that's why sometimes uh, it can hurt uh, hurt uh, somebody lah okay so uh, we try to uh, make sure all of uh, the activity because uh, right now when when most of my daughters or the children use google we ask the parents to use the family link family link to monitor their children activities uh, we we didn't mention that lah, but at least we monitor uh, monitor lah monitor if they uh, did something wrong we just encourage them to uh to we didn't we didn't school them lah we we we, we just uh give them some macam like, awareness lah to improve more okay okay uh next when we talk about uh yeah digital safety uh we also talk about uh behavioral risk content risk and uh, contact risk so uh, uh this is related with uh the attitude our online attitude, our, our, um, our, what you call it, uh, uh, our, 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 our interaction, our uh, online interaction, how, how we, we interact, uh, sometimes we interact it uh, too, too negatively maybe, or too defensively maybe, uh, sometimes we, we try to, uh, eager to win something at the same time we didn't aware that we we hurt somebody maybe something. so we try to try to uh, aware all of those things okay uh, when we, uh, we talk about the uh, content risk we need to aware uh, sometimes the information is not it's not some sometimes uh, when they share the information actually the information uh, was uh, being planned earlier planned from uh, from some other uh, party lah or some other uh, person kan uh, because they just share that information so we need to aware uh, because uh, our this generation is not marketing tools for 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 others lah not not marketing tools in a in a negative way or in a not a proper way for me it's not good lah to be as a marketing tools but for for a positive content for a positive thing it's good to share so we need to uh, regularly teach them what is the good thing or the bad thing lah. and then the contact list we need to know we, uh, we need to share with them which link is not suitable for them and something um, will affect their gadget maybe eh? uh, I, I give example lah. some some sometimes when when uh, uh, much, uh, we, 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 we buy handphone sometimes uh, we want to change the keypad interface we need to 
uh, realize eh, when we change uh, interface the graphic the keep keypad graphic eh, sometimes uh, yeah we, we we use the third party app to change the 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 graphic without knowing that that third party person sometimes they have a, a hidden agenda hidden things uh, because last time back in my yeah when yeah because we are not yeah we, we love to to try things uh, in, back in my degree time uh, my bachelor 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 back in 2000 and i think 1999 to 2004 because we love to create we call it as a virus uh, and then we plan it yeah we we, we really macam creative lah at that time we we try to create that kind of things and, and then make uh, other life uh, other other person life memang uh, te, uh, hor, macam horrible uh, non horrible lah. eh i i i'm not uh, because this is my experience during my teenagers uh uh uh, yeah, this is just last time, like because when we can uh, uh, really love to program, do the programming, and then uh, we love to share our project to others uh, without the knowing that behind that we we park something, we plan something. Uh, and then uh, you just imagine when they uh, key in their password and just imagine this is how hackers do their job. Uh. Because at that time, we love to, macam our ambition to be a hacker, uh, a great hacker, macam tu lah at that time. Eh. So that is the thing that uh, we need to share that kind of awareness to those who love to change the skin because, you, because I always... Uh, remind my daughters uh, if you change the skin you make sure the uh, the yeah the, the 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 developer is the trusted developer uh, and then uh, at least lah, at least you need to study the developer first who who is that person that company uh, if not necessary to change no need to change lah. but if they need to change then they need to uh, uh, aware of that because if the uh, well, the skin uh, have this uh, uh, something like uh, uh, another agenda uh, like what I call it uh, when I key in A and then the uh, the the A information uh, will be sent to an, uh, some some uh, other place uh, so. Uh, it quite, uh, I quite, um, uh, it worried me lah. Okay, so those things we really need to uh, teach this generation to uh, this awareness lah, this awareness so that uh, because most of the third party software is free, so third party apps is free. Sometimes they, they because back on our uh, back, uh, our old days what we want we need to pay then we seriously trying using our money in a proper and a practical way but nowadays most of the things tools apps they can use it freely uh, so they need to choose wisely before they can promote that to their friends uh. Uh, eh? Because kalau lah that uh, that 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 skin give sort of kind of harmful to the phone, and then they promote to their friends, and then their friends uh, without verify that information, they they install that, uh, so they it will it will lead to other 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 uh, not good uh, ending lah. Okay. Next, uh, digital security or yeah, slightly uh, we can call it a cyber security. Uh, this is uh, more to technical hack, uh, hacking, scam, worm. Uh, this is uh, 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 something that uh, 
more technical before this digital safety more to our attitude our behavior online uh, try to uh, not to show the negative negative things because it will record and it will uh, it will uh, record that that uh, that that habit or that behavior online uh, okay so uh, this this one is a uh, digital security uh, relate with the password protection internet security mobile security and so forth this is the technical part uh, so uh, the technical part uh, slightly um, yeah because when we talk about uh, about uh, password protection uh, yeah regularly we will like, try to change our password lah but it quite sometimes macam annoying lah we need to uh, macam always keep uh, change our password again but it's for our own good also okay uh, so uh, how to uh, how to do it uh, then we need to uh, do it in a proper proper way lah okay so internet security mobile uh, security uh, uh, also important uh, okay because right now i think most of our time we will use mobile phone uh, today lah most of our time we we will in, interact using mobile phone kan uh, so uh, sometimes we share uh, our email to other another phone our second phone or third phone uh, without knowing that sometimes you know, we left that phone so that kind of thing uh, we really need to aware and how to how to how to we call it like uh, how to uh, make sure our information didn't didn't uh, others uh, other cannot cannot uh, use our our information from that uh, phone okay so this is just uh, this is just a, some uh, macam awareness lah eh. how to protect your your smartphone i think uh, this is just uh, awareness first uh, we try to perform all software updates please just update the software because company macam like google and uh, apple uh they have their own team uh, working around the to improve the uh, smartphone punya security uh, and then uh if they ask us to update then we just update lah uh, okay uh, although that that uh that updates sometimes can be macam annoying uh, because uh, uh sometimes it uh, will 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 you know sometimes they up, update that but actually it depend on us uh, because we we already uh, set uh, when uh, they can update kan earlier uh, so uh, like myself i always update uh, during uh, uh, 2 am in the morning uh, so uh, it depend on how you manage your 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 your, your smartphone uh. Uh, and then uh, make your smartphone lock sooner uh, ini macam default je lah make sure your phone didn't uh, at least you you need to lock it lock it uh, as soon as possible if you didn't use that okay and then uh, set up a two factor authentication ini uh, maybe for for new login for email kan no, normally lah uh, normally okay and then uh, create long password uh, passcode uh, this is uh, just a default one and then uh, avoid uh, avoid whatever pop up uh, pop up please uh, where so uh, please don't don't on just click uh, because most of the children uh, and now with this 3 uh, years old two and 3 years old when they use phone and uh, when they use phone they just click whatever pop up in front uh, their phone lah. okay so it's quite dangerous lah. okay uh, and then uh, don't jailbreak i think this jailbreak uh, stand for uh, ios anything uh, most of the time uh, because uh, when we jailbreak our phone basically uh, we 
taking down the 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 security measure uh, eh, that uh, was beat by the man manufacturer so please please we we try uh, to to avoid that eh. Uh, this is just uh, just awareness, eh? just awareness because I, I I have this opportunity. I just share this because it is just small small little things, but this is very important. Uh, and then uh, turn auto feel off, uh, especially in using your credit card, uh, because uh, last time I think last year, uh, I will every month I will keep changing my credit card because uh, I don't know why but when I use uh, last time last time last time but uh, I think uh, this year okay uh, last year last year okay last year uh, every month every month I uh, every month I keep changing uh, my, my my credit card because somebody hacked to my credit card and then uh, sometimes they use Almost 1,800, <laughs> okay? So I have no idea where they got that kind of uh, thing, but I suspect uh, based on uh, the credit card uh, company mentioned um, uh, based on the, the messenger, lah, messenger, the Zoom thing, because I subscribe with, with that at that time. Lah, at that time lah, eh? uh, but I think uh, this year, okay. Okay, uh, the next one, the digital emotional intelligence, the ability uh, to be empathic and build good relation with others online, especially when we talk about social awareness, emotional awareness, empathy and sensitivity. When we talk about empathy and sensitivity, uh, it uh, relate with ability our generation eh, uh, understand and share the feeling uh, of another lah maksudnya uh, they, they, they understand uh, how uh, maybe they, are, uh, they try to understand how others feeling uh, so that they uh, didn't 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 uh, do uh, uh, hard, 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 uh, hard things lah to, to others and then uh, emotional awareness, uh, it uh, depend and relate with uh, with uh, uh, explaining their 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 emotion reflect their feelings, okay, uh, and uh, that may be influenced by the, their digital experience and manage their moods according to uh, the daily activity lah. And the last one, the social awareness. This is just like uh, earlier, social awareness. Uh, all about uh, being socially aware uh, because uh, we want this generation understand how uh, to react uh, differently based on the certain, certain situation. Uh, not directly jump into conclusion. Uh, eh? So they need to understand well. And that's why we need to teach them to verify whatever information because that is very important uh, because if we didn't we didn't do that maybe uh, it, it will you know it will you know i think uh, it will be a problem uh, big problem for us Okay, uh, so uh, that is uh, digital emotional intelligence okay we have uh, uh, next. Uh, next, this is just example, is example. how we uh, one uh, uh, just uh, example, yeah, example how we can share positive quotes to others, uh, share them consistently, uh, uh, give a positive and, and a good vibe, positive vibe, okay, uh, and then uh, maybe uh, encourage others to share. Uh, their success story, success story so that it will can uh, encourage others to 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 improve more maybe okay so uh, uh, that is something lah, something that uh, we can do nowadays it's easy without using the complicated complicated tools uh, most of this this artwork 
uh, uh, I I only use uh, Canva online using mobile phone. Okay, uh, and then share with my student or my my team. Okay, so uh, next one, uh, digital communication. Digital digital communication is direct directly uh, relate with uh, the ability to communicate and collaborate using digital technologies and media and it relate with online collaboration online communication and digital footprint based on those three at least the most important thing is the digital footprint okay online collaboration i think it's quite not so old lah, but the term is there for for some time uh, online communication also but the digital footprint because uh, it is a like macam trail of a data or information that uh, when we use online normally we will left something behind eh our record log report eh that those log report actually uh that's why i love uh, exploring e learning for the first time when i explore moodle back in 2004 ke 2006 i can't remember uh, at that 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 time when uh, it gave me uh, the log report the log report means uh, the log activity whatever user they do something it will be recorded there so i think it's good thing because i love to ex uh, to to analyze that 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 uh, that element okay so uh, in digital footprint they have a passive and uh, we call it active uh, passive digital footprint and active digital footprint okay uh, passive digital footprint is a data uh, data trail uh, that you unintentionally leave online okay for example when you visit a, a website uh, the web server may uh, detect your ip uh, identify your browser uh, internet provider and so forth okay and uh, an active digital footprint is where when we directly want to share something uh, based on our uh, activity uh, before this uh, there's uh, one uh, friends uh, or several friends uh, mentioned about sharing i think it's, it's a good thing uh, but we need to aware that whatever we share it being recorded online and that's why I always encourage everybody to do or to share something in a you know, more positively. Yeah. Okay. Uh, and then uh, it also includes uh, data that you intentionally uh, submit online, such as uh, sending email, contributes to your active digital footprint since you expect the data be seen or saved by another person. So the more email you send or content you share, the more your digital footprint grows. Uh, so that's why that's why sometimes uh, you 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 got this 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 commercial or this information. Uh, all all of a sudden you got this information. They 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 send to you directly in your social media. Why? Because uh, they knew uh, maybe you interest in that kind of uh, information. Okay. So since uh, most of the people uh, uh, save their email online or cloud social media, I think uh, 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 that 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 information will will remain quite sometimes, huh? Okay. Uh, so uh, whatever you tweet on your Twitter, ke, every status update you publish on Facebook and every photo you share on Instagram contribute to your digital footprint directly. Okay. The most important thing, the more you spend, uh, uh, the more the more you spend, uh, especially in, macam in social media, eh, uh, on this uh, social uh, networking uh, website, uh, the larger your 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 digital footprint will be okay even liking a page or a facebook post sharing uh, it will add to your digital footprint okay uh, because uh, when we talk about uh, facebook lah since the, the data is saved in uh, facebook new server okay so uh, everyone who everyone use the internet 
nowadays has a digital footprint. So it is not something to be worried about. If you ask me, you just we just enjoy using the internet because uh, since the beginning, actually, if you are a web developer, if you can, you can uh, go to, we call it a C panel, control panel, you can see a lot of more data in there. Uh, and C panel means uh, if you are a web developer, web developer, uh, you can see uh, really in really detailed data in there okay uh, so uh, that's why that's why uh, we just try to use it uh, wisely and do it in a positive uh, manner lah. okay the second last the second last domain okay uh, uh, the digital literacy okay uh, this is just to 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 create a new content okay uh, especially when uh, it relate with uh, this uh, computational thinking uh, and then it relate with this uh, critical thinking and uh, content creation content creation means you create something new new content new ideas uh, especially uh, uh, relate with the literacy element okay uh, this is just uh, digital literacy uh, we need to you know, encourage our 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 generation to share uh, the the good information like uh, what i uh, last time when i want to uh, uh, bought some uh, uh, curtain in nilai nilai 3 eh? nilai 3 so what i uh, where before uh, we went there we 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 read uh, a few blog a uh, personal blog uh, uh, sharing their experience uh, eh? so uh, from there we can make a uh, wise wisely decision where do we need to go uh, without wasting so much time uh. Uh, that kind of thing if we can encourage this generation to share the good things directly based on their experience uh, it will give other uh, I think uh, benefit others uh. Uh, in a such a positive uh, positive way okay and then the last one is last uh, relate with the digital right and I, uh, about this digital right uh, we need to make sure this generation before we, we ask the generation understand this we, we as adults we need to understand that first uh, understand to uh, uphold personal and uh, legal right okay in uh, including the right uh, to what is that? to privacy, intellectual property, freedom of speech, and protection from hate speech. Okay, and that's why I always encourage uh, most of my student or my staff to 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 share uh, the positive positive things. Uh. Okay. So uh, it relate with this uh, privacy, intellectual uh, property rights, and freedom of speech, uh, and then uh, 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 this is something that uh, we need to aware about the inter intellectual property, the copyright thing, because uh, right now, if we really want to understand the copyright element, we also need to understand about the copy left element and the creative commons uh, license so that at least we can uh, make a decision whether we want to go uh, uh, which path okay sometimes we directly want to go to yeah, for the uh, copyright license but some other times maybe we just want to share and share that freely so we can use yeah the yeah, copy left or the creative commons license Okay, so uh, yeah, this is just example about the, the Creative Commons license. I think it's quite uh, popular nowadays. Okay, uh, if, we, if we want to share our slide also, we make sure we put a few licenses there so, so that we declare earlier uh, before we share to others. That is just example. Lah. Okay, so uh, all of this, uh, 
uh, about the digital skills that actually we really need to explore more but this is just uh, the 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 domain and the subdomain based on the digital skills uh, that i really really uh, i think um, love to 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 use because this is uh, this is from the DQ institute and the most like what i said uh, earlier i really love it because uh, they uh, put this uh, screen time in their their uh, in this framework uh, in this in this uh, in this uh, digital skills list okay so i think uh, it's very important uh when it relate with our health our health very important how technology can help to improve our health yeah because our health is very priceless okay so uh i think that's all for 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 our 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 sharing session for today's session so before we we because we have uh, some 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 time uh a little, a, a, a 15 more minutes maybe you can take a look about this uh, digital skills uh, subdomain and domain uh, maybe after this we want to play some activity we want to play kahoot uh, about this uh, digital skills so uh, we try to we try to uh, only only digital skills here yeah. because I, I i i i already uh create uh, some activities about, about this digital skills so uh, uh maybe we can uh, if you uh, want to join that uh, activity so you can go to wait, eh, i share you the link in our chat so that, that we can try and and we, we, we can try try to to answer that that a uh, few questions so uh, later i will i will uh, share the 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 we call it uh, the result uh, in uh, online so that you can you can uh, go and uh, get that uh, result later okay so the, uh, that's the the link maybe we can we can uh, play together because I think I asked my daughter to play this thing because I just imagine I really uh, yeah my daughter yeah my uh, uh, my uh, eleven years old daughters I really share the uh, share her about this digital skill thing so uh, she already knew about all of these skills so she aware most of them uh, so i think she already joined lah, the activity uh, so maybe if you can we can we can uh, we can join that so uh, we try to take just a simple question lah. i think 11 or 12 question so wait eh, i open that link it's the link Oh yeah, yes. Okay. Uh, okay. So you 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 uh, uh maybe you can you can answer a few of uh, that question uh to get that uh that idea about this uh digital skills uh, okay uh can we get slide for reference okay if you want to get this slide maybe you can you can uh i will uh share with a deck maybe maybe a deck will share the slide with you but at the same time uh, i will share this slide if you uh private message me i will share lah. but uh, i think after this i will share this slide to Adek, so Adek will uh, share this. Maybe uh, Adek, I think, uh, will gladly share lah, this slide uh, to you guys. 
Okay, because uh, I actually I I uh, I set this game until twelve uh, o'clock, until uh, until I finish my session. So uh, you just uh, can join this session uh, before twelve only. Uh, actually, that is just a simple, simple, simple question about the digital skills. But if you want to uh, take a look about the the slide, wait, eh? I show back my slide about this digital skills. If you want to, if you want to, uh, 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 use this as a reference, okay. Uh, actually, this is just uh, just maybe after this we will add more these skills uh, based on a few more literature because when we talk about this alpha generation, they are a little bit different, uh, especially uh, especially uh, how yeah their habit and their 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 engagement uh, engagement in using uh, yeah technology more i think more uh i think a little bit different uh, but slightly same with the gen z but uh, they use it uh their time spent in front of the gadget they really don't want to spend uh, uh much time uh, they just want to uh, do it uh in the speed and fast uh, in uh, uh, fast and uh, do it uh, faster. Okay, so uh, we have uh, more uh, 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 only eight minutes. So I share you the the link. Who already shared? Ah, NFU. Okay, NFU is my daughter's. Eh? Okay, because when I ask her, normally, uh, like what I mentioned earlier, um, we we yeah we we conduct uh, uh we conduct we conducted a few much like, post mortem every month. So uh last month when I ask her, okay, I have uh much like, uh I talk with Adek and then I want to create one kahoot about the digital skills. So I want I want you to make sure you you try to answer so that you. Yeah, try to refresh lah. What do you still remember about these digital skills? So, uh, just just uh, that kind of yeah, information lah. Uh, so, uh, it depend on and her lah. Okay, I think uh, uh, I think uh, that's all for today's session uh, so i give back uh, the floor to uh, dr azah so thank you very much for your uh, for your time and hopefully you uh, uh, at least you uh, have learned something uh, from this session thank you. thank you thank you dr sharil i was busy playing the game <laughs> sambil dengar sambil main tak dapat score so but i but i saw uh, Ilham Z. Is that Dr. Ilham me ke? Ilham Z scored uh, next highest after your daughter. Yeah. Who's that? Dr. Ilham me ke? Zul Ilham. Zul Ilham. Ilham. Zul Ilham. Ah, there you go. <laughs> Tania Dr. Dr. <laughs> Tania Dr. Zul Ilham. And then for Linda, uh, on the second, uh, on the third place. So congratulations to those who played the game. <laughs> I, I was giving excuses. I couldn't concentrate. I was playing, <laughs> sorry, sorry. playing the game while <laughs> listening to you. So uh, okay. Um, have you have we addressed all the questions by Doctor? Oh, I saw Doctor Zul. Okay, okay. Doctor Zul Ilham ada satu soalan. What's the best strategy to balance between online and face-to-face -face experience, especially during this pandemic? Yes, have you addressed that, Doctor Sharif? Okay, no, no. Okay, uh, about uh, about that question. Where where's the question? Uh, okay. Chat. Okay. Uh, chat. Uh, eleven o one a.m. Eleven eleven eleven. Eleven o one a.m. Oh, oh, what is the best strategy? Balance between online and face to face experience. Okay. Yes. Um. <laughs> um. 
first the most important thing uh, we need to understand how to uh, interact uh, with human with uh, human directly without using technology that's the first first strategy lah uh, then when we need to use technology then we try to not replicate lah we try to slightly uh, design it slightly near to the real activity uh, real interaction uh, because we because we, uh, what, what what my mentor uh, mentor always uh, remind me uh, when we use technology actually it's not the technology is very important how we want to engage with the with the human is very important the technology is our like macam like uh, the the medium only uh, so we we need to we always updating ourselves with the latest technology because sometimes we just imagine maybe next five years we will uh, communicate with others using VR kan? so they are slightly near to the real actual thing lah. maybe uh, one day we will have the pintu sesuka hati we can go to, to the Raymond uh, we, we, have, we have no no idea maybe maybe yeah uh, okay because mm. last time back in back in uh uh what uh, last 2016 eh? uh when i went to jogja this professor they invented something like uh uh some 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 gadget uh that can you you can taste something when when i i give example uh he he put some durian in the other part and then it the other uh, gadget when we taste that we actually slightly get the same taste from the other side so you just imagine that kind of that kind of product is uh, in in there uh, uh, so we uh, we, we can we, we we still need to be open because uh, that's why I, i always keep reminding myself and my family we need to uh, always uh, updating ourselves not for us for the sake of our children I mean I always uh, uh, because we need to we need to help them uh, because we have this opportunity we have this yeah we have maybe some budget to help them uh, so that kind of that kind of situation uh, okay uh, that that's what 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 I can uh, I can uh, I can I can share uh, try our best to to build our new networking uh, what what i mean by networking uh, uh, okay but what i mean by networking when when we talk about uh, uh, this strategy eh, i also use what i this 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 framework too lah this kesan i always uh, share to my daughters or my student actually knowledge is not everything lah. we still need need to have experience and skill so we have kes knowledge experience and skill at least with knowledge experience and skill at least it can shape us it can shape our attitude uh, that's why uh, but 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 it, but it, we, we still need to have our own new networking because uh, because we are here today because because of our previous kesan to to move to another level we need to improve our knowledge we need to improve our experience we need to improve our skills and also seriously our attitude in managing things and definitely we need to improve our networking to the new level so that we always keep improving uh because why we need to improve because for the sake of our this generation Uh, uh, that that is what 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 uh what can I uh, share? Thank you so much, Dr. Cheryl. Uh, so it it okay. it sends a message that we we have to we have to want to change ourselves. <laughs> yeah, like, yeah. I mean, we are so used to uh, you know, that we come from a generation where students just follow what our lecturer yeah. <laughs> asked us to do at that time during our time, right? But uh yeah, yeah interesting because, to, to because, note. because 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 you just imagine back in my uh, degree my bachelor days uh, most of my uh, assign I, i sold all my assignment that means uh 
uh, when when we do assignment, actually we do the real world program, real world activity. So you just imagine at that time I uh, me as a student, I I got the free consultation from the lecturers who who actually want to evaluate my 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 assignment. But actually that assignment is the real project for client. So you just imagine how I try to mingle around with the opportunity at that time uh, because uh, I built my own my own identity uh, with all those uh, assignments. That, that's why when I joined education, I asked all the students when they share their videos for assignment, actually, uh, I, will, I, 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 I mentioned to them, that is your portfolio. You need to put in your, your own YouTube channel because that assignment or that uh, awareness can benefit to others not only to get your mark you can get something else uh, but before that they need to learn how to use youtube in a proper way lah. <laughs> how to use the right uh, audio how to use the, the 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 certain yeah duration to monetize and so forth so just imagine when they can build their own identity since the first year, uh, just imagine when they graduate from the university, at least they have their own brand, their own identity, their own awareness. They, maybe they have their own fans, community from that assignment. Maybe. Lah. Uh, so that is what uh, my awareness uh, to, 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 to all. Lah. Very true. So it's not just the students, actually. We have to... S- create our own digital identity also. The first digital identity is our WhatsApp profile photo. <laughs> yes, yes. Because that's the, the easiest one that students will connect to us in this digital world, you know, uh, pandemic and things and whatnot. We are moving towards uh, online learning and all those. So apart from yes. Moodle platform, our WhatsApp is our digital profile first and then maybe our yeah. Facebook and whatever not or YouTube so you're saying that uh, we as lecturers also have to build our start building if we have not building our digital in identity so that students can reach us and uh, I think gone are the days where there's the gap between the lecturer and the students in, in, in that strict manner like before but yeah. yeah if there's any questions from the floor if there's any questions from the floor, please just unmute yourself and uh, switch on your microphone. I'm not sure how much time left we have. Uh, can I get some advice from the organizer? How much time more do we have? Uh, it's actually past 12 already, but okay. we can just, as long as Dr. Sharil is available, yeah, yeah. I think it's okay. Uh, yeah, I'm okay. okay, I'm okay. okay. Right. Before that, uh, I would like to remind all participants to go to the chat section and there's a link for the feedback form. So uh, perhaps uh, ADAC can repost the feedback form for those who have not filled it up before uh, we leave. But um, I think, um, is it time to take group photo yet? Before everyone heads to their other activities? May I request that we switch on our camera, take a group photo and then we can continue with the question and answer for those who would like to stay on a bit more and talk personally to Dr. Sharil. Okay, okay. Can, can. Le? Okay, saya. So, I click on my gallery view. I, I stop, I stop uh, sharing. Ah, eh? uh-uh, boleh. Thank you so much. Stop sharing. Okay, I can uh. see uh, Dr. Kamara Zaman, Dr. Suba, Dr. Tengku. Hello, everybody. Dr. Zul Ilham. Uh, ya kan Dr. Dr. Ilhami tadi eh? <laughs> uh, Dr. Varun, nice to see you again. And nice to see some, you too. Some of you may have realised that your the award announcement from Light Tech has been up. So some of you, let's let's give an applaud for all of us who managed to secure one or one award at least, or maybe something from your group. Woohoo! Thank you so much. Yeah, congratulations for those award winners. Okay, when you're ready, organizer, siapa ambil gambar eh? Uh, Jenny, are you ready? Yeah. Okay, alright. All right. The, the rest of you, please switch on your camera when you're ready. Like Dr. Shail say, Google has a, a clause so not to force people to <laughs> switch on your camera. For children, for children. <laughs> for children, okay. <laughs> so, we are not children okay. anymore, so boleh? 
Ready everyone? Smile. One. Ada tak ikhlas ni? Okay, ready? Smile. One, two, three. Okay, next page. Ready? One, two, three. Smile. Alright. Okay. Okay, so pada soalan, if there's any questions or would like to continue the discussion, you're more than welcome to raise up your hand so we could call you out or um, you can just switch on your camera and microphone. Dr. Sharil is here for another, how many minutes Dr. Sharil? I, I have another appointment uh, at 12.30. Uh, 12.30, so we have... Yeah. Before, uh, before 12.30, I think it uh, should if, be okay. If, if there's any lah, yeah, okay? if there's any, uh, now that's your, the chance is here. Anybody? Ada tak? Where's the chat room? Chat, chat lagi ah. lagi. So um, ada kalau tak ada, I would like to officially ah, okay. officially end the session. Thank you so much for your knowledge sharing, Dr. Sharil. Okay, thank you. We learn so too. much. We learn so much from you. Yes, yes. From your experience, your your. Your learn by doing. I think your your motto is learning by doing. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Everything that you have tried, and you force your students to learn by doing by you know the assignment itself is sellable as <laughs> a commercial value by it at the end of it. Yeah, I'm sure the students also appreciate that. So um, yeah, I would like to end the session formally. Thank you okay, so much, everybody. Thank you, everybody. See thank you. you. Bye -bye. Stay safe. Please yes. stay safe. Eh? You too.